Hello there and welcome to your weekend forecast issued this Thursday the 8th of August. I split the headline into two, the northern half of the UK and the southern half. For the north, that's Scotland, Northern Ireland and also Northern England, we will see an increasing threat of thundery rain as we head through Saturday with a risk of flooding. We've already seen quite a lot of flooding across Scotland through the last few days and this will exacerbate the situation. The river levels are high, they're swollen. We've seen a lot of surface water, particularly on that rain track between Glasgow and Edinburgh and this is not going to help. Feeling cooler, particularly across the north of Scotland where we will see that cloud uh, persisting. Further south, the biggest issue, the biggest impacts will be strong winds. On Saturday, we could see gusts up to 50 miles an hour in places. Obviously, gale force winds causing some choppy seas. And then come Sunday, it's a case of sunshine and showers, although currently we're looking at more showery rain across northern England and north Wales. So this is an unseasonably deep area of low pressure, which is tracking across the UK through Friday into Saturday. The rain warning remains in force through Friday night before it eases. And then on Saturday, thunderstorms in the north, winds in the south. Gusts, as I said, could actually be damaging, particularly across coastal regions. But even in land, we could see gales. These thunderstorms here will be slow moving. You're in the center of the low. So if you catch some thundery rain and it lasts a while, again, the risk of a flooding here. So first thing on Saturday morning, you can see where the low is, the strongest winds always across England and Wales, some damaging gusts along the coast, along the south coast, the west coast as well, west, west Wales, northwest England, but even in land. And then it's this swathe of showery rain, which will be slow moving across Scotland, extending down towards Cumbria, as, as well as Northumberland and towards Northern Ireland as well. So the risk of some localized flooding here a blustery end to the day across the south. Some sunshine coming through here and also some heavy showers. Temperatures then, well, if you catch some sunshine, 22, 23 degrees Celsius, although feeling fresh in that wind. A similar situation for Northern Ireland. Later, we could see some brighter weather just sort of poking its head through the southwest of Scotland. Elsewhere, though, those showers will be slow moving and they will rumble on through Saturday into Sunday. So a reminder of where our weather warnings are for the latter part of Saturday. This area of low pressure here extends towards Scandinavia. But as you can see, there's a trough extension down towards Ireland. And what that means, this is where we're likely to see the unsettled weather remain through Sunday. Some uncertainty at the moment at, with the distribution of this showery rain. It could be further south. To be honest, wherever you are, you're never going to be too far away from those showers. Always more clouds across the north of Scotland, a stronger wind here, feeling cool under that cloud and that showery rain. You can see here, stronger winds persist across England and Wales in between sunshine and showers. And then temperatures through Sunday, typically coming in, I'd say the low 20s, the high teens, however, much cooler across central and northern areas of Scotland where it's going to feel autumnal. So all in all, the weekend is looking unsettled rain or showers, stronger spells of wind as well. Keep up to date with the forecast and also with the warning zones. Make sure you take extra care if you are traveling or doing anything outside through the weekend. Obviously, we'll keep you up to date on all our social media channels. Bye-bye.